Hola. Hola, chicas. ¿Qué onda, amores? ¿Cómo andan? Bienvenidos a la segunda parte de 24 horas hablando inglés. Voy a empezar ahora. Mm, I'm so tired. Um, today is Wednesday, 23rd of November, I think. It's half past six in the morning. I'm about to make myself some breakfast because I have to go to school. But the good news is that I finished at midday today, so it's not a really long day. I'm going to explain you why this looks like this Okay, I was preparing my breakfast and really asleep and I was thinking to record the video so I had like my head on another universe so I was like starting to make the tea and what I do every single morning is I take the little bread with chocolate I put it on the microwave so about like 10 seconds and then I take it off and I continue doing the tea or the coffee or whatever I, I feel like having that morning but today I was thinking like I have to record this and that and then Julie woke up earlier and so I was talking with her and I completely forgot that the bread was on the microwave in the microwave so it started like to do a really loud noise like an alarm and when I turned around it was like all full of smoke and I was like oh I forgot the bread was in there and I left it like three minutes my hair is so full today and the fire alarm started ringing and i was like really nice way to start the day i'm so glad that julie was awake because other way i would feel like so embarrassed um that's it my room is so nice the day is awful i opened the window a little bit so that the air would like change a bit but it's getting really cold now i'm gonna brush my teeth and i think i'm almost ready My hair is a mess. Basically today I have the second hour of art So I have this free first period And then I have form time that it's like place, like a coaching time Where the teachers, I don't know, we talked about professions, about how to stand economically And then I think I have another free time and my last hour is English and then I'm free I heard that today, I mean uh, every single Wednesday they have like a free pancakes day or something like that where they like give pancakes hot drinks like tea hot chocolate i've never been there so i think i'm gonna stay a little bit more because i think that it's on midday like on lunch time so i'm gonna see how it goes and record it for you i'm gonna show you the things i'm working on at the moment here it is this is basically the drawing that I created with three different angles of the same objects And then we recreated the drawing that we already had but like on a board and drawing by hand from the scratch And also painted with acrylics and stuff And this is basically what we are doing right now This is like the theoretical part of the work There's an essay that we wrote some weeks ago the color palette that we had to do based on an artwork that we decided that I've chosen this one and I also printed a picture of the other one, a big drawing to include it here with some written 
of how I achieved this by creating these three drawings and then cutting them on the guillotine and putting them back together here. I also wanted to add a picture of the digital one, but I need a smaller one because it's not really fitting in. Put it like over here and in here the final drawing and I think that's it. Oh, and I also need to add this because it's like the source is where I take the information from for the essay, but I don't want to like stick it here because it's gonna ruin the whole thing. So I was trying to look like for a plastic thing. I'm gonna try to look it up and just do it and then I'll show it to you. On the classroom we have like all the materials here so you can come and just decide what to take. There's like whiteboard, color cardboard, it's new spring craft. I don't know what's this. Oh, this type of paper. And in here you have like piece of books that you can put into newspaper, maps. For example, here is a work of a girl that is doing it like with book pages. This is what I was looking for. They literally have every single material that you imagine. Right now it's 10 to 11 and I have form at 11 o'clock so I'm just here waiting outside the classroom. I don't think I'm gonna be able to record that much because it's literally just like 25 minutes talking about life in other words. Okay, it's half past one and I'm already free. The wind is not nice. What I showed you before is basically that pancake day that I told you on a regular classroom. They give away uh, once a week, that is on Wednesdays, lunchtime, give away pancakes and hot chocolate. And it's nice because you can go there and just have a seat and talk to your friends and there's music and yeah it's really nice and it's free and i'm also gonna show you some videos of the other library not the one that i went but the one from primary school i get but it's a little bit bigger so i'll leave you the videos right now I just got home and I saw like this envelope with my name on it. My mom sent it. Okay, unboxing because I have no idea what's in here. Oh, Today is 23rd of November and my 17th birthday was two days ago. And it's like a letter from my sister. There's another one here from my brother and this is from my mom so i'm gonna read it i'm not gonna show this to you because it's kind of private but like i'm so glad i love you all so much okay, i have to do several things i have to edit the harry potter video and i have to do some artwork i know i have some homework but i have no idea what is it i'm freezing so i want to go and take a shower first okay i'll go first to look for my laundry because julie's been doing some washing she leaves our stuff here and we just take it
because the, the trying will be. Okay, it's almost 7 here. I already dried my hair and had dinner, so I'm just chilling. I'm gonna see if I can get the artwork done, but that's it by now. I'm gonna keep you updated. I also want to see if tomorrow I have some free time to show you the music room because I think I've never showed it to you, at least not on YouTube. So, okay, I'm here on the basement of the school because I'm trying to find the music room i've been here only once so i'm kind of lost but like there it is This is huge and it's full of, look at the amount of ukeleles. There is a, I don't know the word in English, bajo. The room is literally so cool and it's full of every single instrument that you can imagine. I think last time that I played the guitar was like in August before coming here.